Right, before we get into today's video, if I sound ill, it's because I am ill. I've got a cold and I'm just not feeling very well. And secondly, uh, yes, another real life video is coming. I'm editing at the moment, but you've got to understand it's like three hours of footage that I'm editing and everyone's got to record. Bearing in mind, a lot of people live in like other countries and it's just a lot of hassle. But I don't know if you guys remember the YouTube boxing event called Social Knockouts a couple of months ago. If you ago. don't remember, let me jog your mind. Uh, a YouTuber called Slim, a lot of people know him, and NNA Productions fought on this card it wasn't like a massive thing it wasn't a massive event but it was there it was held in coca-cola arena or stadium and they're doing a second one and no your eyes are not falling you it says a live performance from the baby when i saw live performance of the baby it confused me because it's quite a low-key event not many people know about it and when they did the reveal there was only 23 likes on it in 15 hours what? So this is the whole lineup of people, and to be honest, I only really care about Slim and NNA Productions, and obviously now the baby, but I only care really about them. So <coughs> Sorry about that. So I was quite interested in this event, so I was trying to look into the date, and it's the 15th of October, and normally the 15th of October seems like a quite ordinary day, but it's not, because two of the biggest movies of the year are coming out, Halloween Kills and Venom Let There Be Carnage, so they could have chosen a worse and day. Yes, I'm aware not everyone's going to watch those movies when they come out on the first day, and not everyone's going to watch this boxing fight, but I just find it funny how they could have chosen any day that wouldn't clash with two of the biggest movies of the year, but they chose the day where two of the biggest movies of the year come out. I, I, it, just, it just makes it even more funny that the baby's on it. It's in Coca-Cola Arena again, and two of the biggest movies... Out of the whole year and probably out of the past two years are coming out. It just make, makes me laugh. Right, guys, we're here at Social Knockout uh, Trials. Next generation. Inside six different big events. Inside six different big events. Inside six Oh, that trailer has made me so excited. Also, why did they make a trailer? I'm not saying they can't have a promotional video because, completely fair enough, you want to promote it as much as possible. Bearing in mind your posts are getting like 25 likes. Fair enough. But you're making a trailer to try and promote this thing when surely they know, like, they might have a hint that Let There Be Carnage and Halloween are coming out on that date. Surely it right? also makes it even funnier. Because they've been hinting at this for ages, but in the trailer, they've been acting like they haven't been hinted at it, and this is brand new information. It's not brand new information. No one gives a fuck. That's why they think it's brand new information, because no one cares about this enough. Except for me, of course, because, you know, slim NO productions and just content. And I think it's worth to point out, there are no outstanding fighters here that I'm actually really excited to see. I'm not excited to see NNA productions, because if he gets clobbered again, it's going to be a waste of my time. And I'm not excited to see Slim, because he's a skinny little kid i don't i'm not excited to see any of these people it's just it's funny that they've got the baby and all of these people on here and they're trying to make it so serious but no one cares enough about this event they have not done a good job at promoting it and when they have they've done a very very poor taste on what date they have chosen this event to be it really feels like them setting themselves up to fail here which isn't a good idea especially because you've still got to pay these creators So guys, the social knockout to his f Hold on, Mr. NNA Productions, have we just skipped a whole event here? A third one already? Fuck me, the second one must have been quick. They stand there, just not knowing what to say or do for the first second, and it makes me cringe so hard. I love how they've been doing YouTube for maybe, what, five, six, seven years now, and they still don't know how to react in front of a camera, it's just quality. Finally confirmed that I'm gonna be fighting! Yeah! Slim! No, no, I'm not fighting. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> There's not much else to deduce from this, there isn't much content there. I just find it hilarious how there's a second one. The first one, people watched it, people talked about it, but it wasn't massive hype because of the creators. 
And now they've got to bait me, and it's still no hope there. There's still nothing going on there. They've got to build it up more. I just think they've chosen an unfortunate date for the event. If they moved it, maybe a couple of days afterwards or before, I think that the event could do completely good, and I think that they could have a chance to succeed in there. And again, it's the little pause when he looks down at his camera. Can't he hit the off button or at least edit it out? It doesn't take long to edit out, like two seconds. The file would upload so quickly. I, I, I don't get it. It's not even for comedic purposes. He's just forgot to turn off a camera. So yeah, we're coming to that sad time where it is the end of today's video. I just want to say again, an apologies for me being ill. I wanted to push this video out as quickly as possible to let everyone know that this is going on. Again, the YouTube's being quite dry at the moment with stuff. So this is quite a big thing I want to jump on for me. But yes, I am ill and I've been coughing and splurging this video. It's been terrible. A lot of it I've edited out, but it's just terrible at the moment. So thank you for watching today's YouTube video. If you did enjoy today's video, please consider subscribing because all the subscribers and likes would help me out a lot. So yeah, this has been your host Samuel and he's been it. Peace.